It's a big night for Southern California's party animals. Chipper and Cleo have their four-legged friends stopping over for food, games, and a pinata full of fun. What's in there? What's in there? Because when you live like Arden Moore's fabulous furry Fab Four, it's all about learning, laughing, loving, and living the good life. When I grew up, I had animals. But it wasn't until I was an adult that I really realized that there's a connection I have with them. So I guess my pet tale is, I'm telling the tales of what pets can bring to us. Most early mornings, you'll find Arden, Chipper, and Cleo exercising with friends in Southern California's growing fitness craze. Leash your fitness. Looking good. Bikini season is upon us. Switch. I felt that I would be more true to my workout if I worked out with my dog. Nice. Jump. You do cardio. You do strength exercises. They're going up the A-frame and down while you're trying to hold your yoga pose. They're slobber kissing you. Last one, awesome! I always tell people a tired dog is a happy dog. I love presenting pet talks to kids. Now here's kids are smart. They're our next generation of pet ambassadors. How many of you have cats? I want to show you. What do you think? Arden's pet talk partner is Ziki an abused kitten who was adopted by Arden. She won't bite, she's a sweetheart. This little spunky go. survivor goes out in public with me and is just full of love, and I think she's gonna help cats everywhere. She might kiss you, especially if you had turkey today. It's a tale of purpose presented in a fun way. Usually, you'll find Ziki perched above Arden as she shares information and tales about the four-legged life. They are a constant living reminder of what I'm doing in life. With apologies to the centipedes, I am all about the two, three, and four-leggers on this planet. I devote my life to animals and people. The blog for Four-Legged Life, it's a pet community where people can learn about pets with videos, radio clips, photos, and the motto is to laugh, love, and learn. And if you can do that with your pets, pause up, you're great. It's been four years since Cleo became one of Arden's Furry Fab Four, which is cause for a rebirthday. Believe it or not, Dog parties are the party you want to get an invite to. Give me 10. Now both paws. Nice. There's like 10, 15 million people who will confess that they have given a dog party for their dog. Trust me, I put a little bandana on that says Cleo. Oh yeah, she knows something big's happening. There's your friend Sophie. All these big and little dogs come. It's a party. Are you ready to party now? You guys ready to play, Snoopy Says? <laughs> Take me out to the wolf park. Take me out to the dogs. Oh. This has got to be the first time I have ever used a fire hydrant shaped pinata. And we filled it with uh, good doggy treats and safe tennis balls for dogs. And it was a hoot to see the little itty bitty dogs sniffing it. I smell something good in there. And then the big dogs that are like, oh yeah? Let me show you how to open it up. Arden Moore wears many collars in the pet world. Yes, there are parties, presentations, books and blogs, but mostly, Arden's tale is a love story. My pet tale is, I have found that pets teach us to live in the moment. Pets teach us to be candid. She goes, I like this, this is good. Pets teach us that, you know, the fire hydrant on the other side isn't always the best. And they teach us, it's okay to give it a shot. You might even succeed. And if you don't, they still love you. 